Hello, this is Paula, and I'm bringing you another review today. This time, the company um, is Village Candle, and the scent is Coconut Milk and Lime. Now, I found this at TJ Maxx um, just, I think, last week. Uh, normally, this jar is $9.99. It was on a clearance for $6. And that was um, pretty inviting to me considering I don't really need another candle right now but I wanted to try it I've had a really good experience with the village candles um, and I think I know why this was on the clearance rack and there were two of them I actually left the store and had to go back another day and it was still there so I went ahead and got it for that six dollars even though I was a little hesitant based on the scent of this um, and what I mean by that, well, let me back up. Um, I love lime in all citrus fragrances, and I love coconut. Like, I really, really love coconut. And um, so the combo sounded amazing. I think that it's a really pretty color, if you can kind of see that green. Um, and if you look at the wax pool, look at this. That is just really nice. There's not one wick dropping it sounds weird to say it like that but you know what I mean the little black specks or flecks of wick um, and it's only just now as these flames are pretty high it's only just now about to do a little bit of like a blackening sooty thing but it's not if you can see there's no soot yet um, on the glass so it's really an interesting burn um, now I could smell the fragrance um, and my hesitation was it didn't smell a lot like lime it didn't smell a lot like coconut it's almost like a really interesting subdued fragrance of maybe both of those in fact when you look at this label um, let's see if I can show you this see how that coconut is kind of like a woody looking you know the, the outside of a coconut is really rough and everything well it almost smells, I almost feel like it might smell like that, like a more of a woody tone or sense that I'm getting from the candle, but um, look at it, it's such a beautiful candle. So for the ambiance, um, that side of things, it just gets, a, you know, all the points it can. Um, it's a beautiful burn, clean, even, and, but for the scent, it's, it's just not a whole lot to write home about. Um, in terms of the lime and the coconut. So I, I don't even know that I'd say it's super disappointed because I knew what I was kind of smelling when I bought it and it smells just like that on the burn. It doesn't smell worse, it doesn't smell better. It smells exactly how it smells in the store. So if you see that and you get to smell it, um, it smells just like that when it's burning. And it'll fill up a small room. I do want to say one more thing about Village before I go. And that is, I feel like they've got their science uh, down to an art in terms of the size of their wick um, that they use, or the wicks rather, because it's always been two um, when I get these large jars. And then the, the way they blend their candles, it always seems really consistent throughout. So I feel like what I'm getting right now, I'm going to get that all the way down to the bottom, including the fragrance and everything. It's just a really, you almost see like these little bubbles in there. Look how pretty that is. I, I really don't see that. There's like little diamonds in there. Anyway, um, it's a nice candle. So it's weird for not liking the scent too much. I really still kind of like this candle. That's pretty weird for me. Um, I do need to extinguish these flames really quickly and I need to uh, realign them as well. But I wanted to share my experience with this candle. I, it's hard for me to describe what I am smelling. It's almost like there's more, a lot more going on. I would love to know all the mid um, and the top and the bottom notes of this uh, candle if they do it the same way Yankee does. Just because out of just sheer interest to me, it would, it would be of interest to know. Um, so um, I may not repurchase this again unless it, they reformulated it to smell a lot more like coconut. And lime I think it's just more of that coconut milk when we think of coconut I think we think of the coconut the, the fleshy white part of it um, 
and like or a toasted coconut that you might like do in the oven for a minute and get like real brown and toasty on top of a coconut cream pie but this is focused more, I think, on the coconut milk, and it's kind of true to that. I don't know that coconut milk has a lot of strong coconut smell as much as the flesh of a coconut does. So that's kind of my attempt to explain how this smells. Um, but it is a beautiful candle, very typical of Village in my experience. This particular one, because of the light color, is especially pretty on the burn. So for $6... It might be worth picking up for that because the, the scent is not unpleasant to me. It's not like, ew, gross or anything. It's just, it doesn't really wow me. So, but I do love Village Candles and happy to try this one. Um, but it's probably not a repurchase. So thank you so much for watching. Hope you have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.